Sasha Kobe. Sasha. Oh my God. She looks so fucking sexy on that car. I'm like, bitch, she's just waiting to be fucking real. Um, I don't love her promo look, though. I mean, the reveal look. I don't love the reveal look. Yeah, I like it from like. Uh, yeah. I don't like I'm it from anything it. or any angle. I don't love this look, <laughs> but I do love her promo look. The promo look is really, really sexy. I think she looks great. And I also mm -hmm. see this is a shoe that that's kind of. This is a shoe that's kind of strappy, but it also has enough elements that you're not just looking at one little piece of whatever across the toe. I think that's a great way to wear a strappy shoe, in my opinion. And I love that she let these bitches know. She's like, I've been, she's, she's like, I'm not new to this. I've been doing drag for a very long time since before. Well, she's a, she's a former Miss Continental. She's a former Miss Continental. The what? 2012. And she has a great line. I'm your favorite drag queen's favorite drag queen. I Which is a fact. Love that. I love that. She's from Hawaii, but she lives here in LA. She's like her aesthetic is goddess slut. Um, what did she say? I thought was kinda of weird. She was like, My split set me apart. And I mean, I'm like I mean, she but she said she can do it all sideways, front ways, back ways, diagonal ways, quarter ways. I mean, but we'll see. But I mean, I have seen, there have been some videos of Sasha Kobe circling around online for a long time. Sasha is a very captivating performer. I and agree. I will say, there is a way that some girls dance and the way they move. I think there's a lot of stuff that sets Sasha Kobe apart. For me, it's the fact that she's one, it's just a, a like, even like, I've, honestly, some of my favorite performances about Sasha Kobe is where she hasn't done a single split. It's just her being gorgeous, like the way that she embodies a song. I think she's really, fun. anyway, she's really sick to me. Um, I am America's next superstar. I am America's next drag superstar because I am already a drag superstar. Just give me the crown. Honestly, I love that. I think that's a great way to answer. She's like, bitch, I am a drag superstar. That's probably my favorite answer so far, actually. That's my favorite answer so far. I'm torn between Sasha Kobe because I love, I just really love the line, I'm your favorite drag queen, favorite drag queen. And, and she had my favorite reason why she's America's next drag superstar. But I also really enjoyed Lucy LaDuca. She, she was just funny to me. She was just so funny. You have to pick one. You can't have. You can't have two. I'm gonna go with, um, with Sasha Kobe because she had my one, she had my favorite line and she had my favorite reason why she's America's Next Drag Superstar. Who is gonna be the top three? Top three. Ooh, uh, Sasha, Irene, and uh, Lucy Laduca. I'm saying Sasha, Irene, and Lux. And if we had to do a top four, I'm gonna add Mistress Violet in there. If I have to add a fourth, I'm gonna add in Selena. In walks Sasha Kobe, who looks absolutely stunning, absolutely stunning. I'm also just really moved that she, that she, that she, that she. I don't know. It, it's a really simple thing, but like she said, "Aloha." It's really, it's, it's giving Kanaka Mahu. It's giving like, it's really fierce. I don't even know if she is um, Kanaka, but I, or uh, you know, Indigenous Hawaiian. Um, but I know she's from Hawaii. Yeah, she's obviously had a lot of time to perfect her craft. She walks in and just has one word. Period. 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 That is a great interest line. Bitch, they were screaming oh. like she was the fucking um uh celebrity guest, celebrity judge. I know. I <laughs> they, know. They were screaming like, like she was the celebrity. I said, oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Uh, did you clock that when Rue walked in, Sasha walked over like a baby and said, Mama? <laughs> no, I didn't see that. That shit, I don't know why that took me out so much. I had to rewind it like three times. She walked over there, she goes, Mama. I don't know what that is so little. <laughs> I don't think anyone else clocked it besides me, but that shit was so that sh I'm not a person who clips it. Someone needs to meme that. Someone needs to meme her going, ma ma ma. Straight jacket, straight jacket drag, not a type of drag. You mean you have a lot of straight jackets? There's not this. There's not this. Speak for yourself. Speak for yourself. There is not this subculture of straight jacket. Bitch, speak for yourself. Just because you don't, just because you don't know anything about straight jacket drag. Me and Sasha, we're on the same page. Me and Sasha Kobe, we're one we're one in the kind, honey. Yeah, I could have been a miscontinental if I wanted to. And I still might be. I gotta go pee. Hold on one second. And don't don't talk any shit like while I'm gone. Miss Sasha Kobe. Um I this is, nice, this, this is the this is the gown she wore, uh the evening gown she wore the year that she won Miss Continental. Um Continental. She looks good. Yeah, she looks good. Looks good. Yeah. That's a good look. Yeah. Uh, um, oh, she has foxtails too. The girls, pa pageant bitches love a foxtail, right? Save, save the whales. Save the turtles. What about the foxes? We don't talk about the foxes enough, I don't think. 
Yeah, I think that you you're right. Thank you for bringing thank you for bringing awareness to that money. Yeah. What do you think of this team? Would you have, would you would, it, would this be the team you picked? Yes, I because I think first for the, yes first challenge. Anitra did a great job. Um, Selena is a is clearly a good actor. So everyone is mm -hmm. going off the prowess and like the legend of Sasha. And I think Lux is good too. I would I like this team a lot. I would pick this team. Yeah, I would have picked this team too. This is a this is a great team. This is a really really good team. In in the edit, they made it look like Sasha Colby wasn't do, wasn't doing a good job. Yeah, but the bitch, I I love the way they edited because Sasha Colby was the fucking we'll get, superstar. We'll get there. We'll get there. We'll I, know, get, I know. But also, but also, but Michelle's note to her because when she wasn't doing bad in the in the in the in the edit, she goes, "I know you can do better." I'm like, that is not a director's note. Anytime they have these these soft moments and the girls be looking, Malaysia has her highlight and her thing. Sasha Colby literally looks like a D. She looks like a hell spawn. Like Sasha Cole, Jacob screenshot this well, and send it to Jay. The mid process. The mid the mid drag process is banana. Group one and each group. Sasha F Sasha of oh, Valor. Sasha Colby as God was fucking brilliant. The next snap thing, it is so it good. Was so, I agree with Paul. Every time she did it, I laughed. Same. This was a this was very funny. So um, good. Between um, Selena and Sasha, this was, they really, I mean, the whole, everyone was good in this, but they really, like, sold this and just made it, they were obviously the main characters, but they so made good. it just fucking amazing. It was so funny, it was so well done. I like this, I like this look too. I wish that the front part, um, was either closer to her body, because it feels mm. like the, the, the thing is like, all, it's like, it's like floating off her body a little bit, but she looks really stunning now. So, Monet, based on what we know, Who's going to win RuPaul's Drag Race season 15? Based on what we know, let me look at these girls Who's again. Who's going to win? So for me, I think that the finale, the top three is going to be, I'm going to give the top three to, um, okay, I'm going to slightly change it. I'm going to say Anitra, Sasha Colby, and Lux Noir. Nope. Anitra, nope. Sasha Colby, Lux Noir, and Mistress Isabel Brooks. Top three. Let's go on to Sasha Colby, who I think may have been on camera for a blip of a second. Um, yeah. I'm she not looks like Jane with Crouch. Jane. I'm not super familiar with Jan Crouch, um, so I, I don't, I don't, I, I don't know if she did a good job or not. But she, but it wasn't particularly funny, from what I did see. Um, and I will say when when Ren Rue introduced her and she was like, I mean, I'm praying for her, and she put the the, the cross at Lucy. Lucy says, Ah, it burns, Rue, it burns. I thought that was very funny. But also, Lucy ate that joke up. Yeah, like 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 it was like that's what I like meant. Sasha, I thought Lucy was funny. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I'm gonna give Sasha a. Uh, a six, yeah. I give Sasha, I give Sasha a six as well for look, and because this does look like Jan Crouch. Like you look up, you, of course, it's like a bit dragged up because it's she's yeah. doing Gerard. Bitch, Jan like, Crouch was dragged up. Right, right. I would say, but Jan Crouch had bigger hair. Ironically, like Jan Crouch was like, was what like, an odd. These televangelist ladies were wild. They make they make us drag queens look subtle down. <laughs> Sasha Colby, who is a tree a spider a spider tree <laughs> a witch a She's swamp a witch spider. <laughs> i don't know what she is, but she uh, she looks amazing i like I the gown really i don't love like the makeup look. i do i don't know i, and I think that sasha kobe might actually be doing at this point in the competition the most diverse makeup in the entire competition out of everyone is she? Yeah. I think she's switching it up the most, actually. But I wish that the gloves were maybe... I wish... Because what's taking me oh, out... Oh, the gloves are my favorite part. The gloves are my favorite part. I like the fingers, but I, we know how... Like, these look like just satin gloves that we buy, that you can buy at, at B&Q Trimming or any store in New York, and just put things on it. If she, if there was a way so she could incorporate those vines to, like, come out of the gloves, make it, like, feel like it was one thing, as opposed to just, like, satin glove, things on them, I think that's what's taking me out of it. She looks divine. But the there was a, a great there was a great moment during Untuck where she looks at like spice or sugar and she goes, "Pinky promise me." And they they're they're pinky promising with the long <laughs> the shit really <laughs> terrible. I'm, I'm gonna give it to Sasha Colby. I really like Sasha Colby's look. I it's so good. I, I think I would if I, the one I would wear most likely is Aura Mayores, but I just like the way Sasha Colby looked when she came out on the runway. Um, Sasha Colby is doing, in my opinion, the perfect amount of like. Working the runway and selling the garment, 
where it's, where it's, where she's not like doing something like what Sugar and Spice or Aura are doing. She's giving you a little bit of the nuttiness, but also just runway. Sasha and Lux's looks are my favorite. Yeah. But I kind of want to see them in more content. I just saw them in clips, but they were they were both really good looks. I love Sasha's look in this. She looks so cute. I in the in the challenge? No, just in the in the workroom. Like she's just sitting there, she's wearing like this little polo. She looks so adorable. I, remember. I just remember I just remember thinking to myself, I love this workroom look. She looked really, really I actually since I DM'd her, the, her the, the thing and I was like, You look so adorable here. Oh, um, when 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 did Sasha unblock you? Sasha never blocked me. When does RuPaul when did, why did RuPaul unfollow you? You never answered that question. Okay, Sasha first Sasha and Lux are going at it. Yeah. Like Sasha's like I think that Lush, I think that Lux and Mistress were like trying to like Kiki. And yeah, well, Kiki can. But, but but also sometimes everyone don't want to fucking Kiki. I really like Sasha's confessional look with the gloves. The I gloves like look it. so wild. So every time I forget, and then she does something, I'm like, oh, I think she looks fierce. Um, let's go to the rockin' OGs. Sasha, I'm calling out Granny's, putting the dentures in the air, cracking his neck. Thank God for cracking Medicare. This neck. Cracking Girl, this neck. Okay. Thank God for Medicare. Feeling all yummy, just like the shrank tease. Cardiac arrest, what? Bitch, Bitch please. please. Arthritis in my wrist, joint pain in my knees. Can't laugh too hard. Crap, did I just pee? Call me old, baby. Call me fire. Call me now, because I know, because I now retire. Okay. I thought this was good. She this referenced was herself. One of the best verses. She referenced herself. Some really good jokes. Her physicality her was. Her physicality was so, very like good. Like that little the walk she was doing. Yeah. Her voice, I love what she, I, her voice was un recognizable yeah i thought she did a great job i am genuinely gagged by that what she did not win this episode because her look was great really her performance was great i am gagged that she didn't win this episode i was really especially with her tie-dye was so good that was really good and her I mean, we're, really we're gonna good. Hit, sorry we're gonna hit ourselves, yeah. we're gonna hit ourselves. okay but so, and also the way that she pushed malaysia out of the way and the faces she made she was eating she was eating basha mother tucking colby this is perfect yeah she looks really good this is perfect sasha colby looks amazing the the hat the the way it's dripping the makeup the way that her shoes match this is who's your favorite look Oh, Sasha Kobe. Sasha. Sasha Kobe. This is so she good. She looks so fucking hot. I would fuck this queen. She looks so hot. Yeah, this outfit is amazing. Sasha is... Ooh. is Sasha has pretty consistently, uh, especially for the past three weeks, done some really amazing looks on the runway. And yeah. she is just... She's a... This, this bitch is a fucking great drag queen. Like, she is a fucking drag queen. Yeah, this looks very good. Like how it, it's not just a regular little bodysuit. How like the different pa this looks the asymmetry of it. I, Sasha looks so 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 good. And, and the hair. What I mean when I say like you know, um, Lucy just put on like a white leotard, and the <laughs> Sasha seemed to have thought really thought about the elements of like not just putting on just like a, a half yellow half black leotard. She really. It's there's so there's so many design elements going on. Yeah, not just the coat, you know. Then Sasha Colby and Anitra gets to choose a song. She chooses "I'm in Love with a Monster." I love this song. I <laughs> love this song. Oh yes, yes, yes. Is this the best lip of the This is the best lipstick of the night. Easy. Yes. yes. Easy. Both of them with their hair flips, gorgeous. They both are just so in charge of their bodies. They're good movers. They're, they're using their, it's just such good visual performers, both of them. Yeah. So I think it was a good I pairing. I agree. That being said, Sasha ate down. This was easily Sasha's round. Yeah. The the way she, the way she paced her number was perfect. The way she, she, she just did it. This was a very, very, was, there was enough variety in her moves. This yep. was a great, performance it it, it if, if if even if this wasn't lipstick for your life if a nietzsche wasn't there this would have still been a perfect performance yes and i gotta and say what uh, sasha not. colby was wearing like the whole outfit head to toe worked mm -hmm. to her advantage it worked all together as a premium package for me the outfit was amazing yeah but sasha ate and it is it is it is a competition, darling. And someone Ooh. has to lose and someone has to win. And <laughs> Sasha Colby has won. Oh, this one. Sasha Colby. Um, this first look, I, look uh, no. No. I like it. I think it looks like something Taylor Swift would wear to an award show. No, you remember when Taylor Swift was wearing look at, when Taylor Swift was wearing these two piece gowns? 
I, I remember, but this doesn't like that. This looked like Taylor Swift got if she if, the, if it was sold at Rainbow. I like the outfit. I don't like her second look though. I, you know what it is, but I have a bias right. against people putting things on their head. I hate when people just put. A, I hate when people put a thing on their head. I hate people glue stuff to their shoes, especially if you have big feet. <laughs> And I hate when you put <laughs> Britta a filter. Prop. Right when Britta filter put the whole would not ball. stop. <laughs> well, she wouldn't stop gluing stuff to her feet. But I do love her. But yeah. I, but I do love her third look a lot. Her I shoes like are amazing. Look. But she brought those from home, so I don't you like don't this know. third look. That is an assu- that is an assumption. You don't you don't know maybe. what kind of um, what kind maybe of she made, maybe maybe yeah maybe she's a maybe she's a cobbler. She made those in yeah, the workroom. Yeah, maybe uh, 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 Colby cobbler, uh, Sa- <laughs> Sasha, Col- Sasha Sasha cobbler. So we find out that the winner of this week's challenge is Sasha Colby. Do you agree? No, I would have given it to either Anitra or Mistress. Actually, I would have given it to Mistress. I think um, each of Mistress's looks was was good. I enjoyed Sasha's interaction with uh, with Charo. They, I love. I do love when she threw those cards away. Agreed. Agreed. Um, she was. She was just. She was in the moment with Charo. It was great. Yeah. I think yeah. she did a really good job. There's something so professional about how Sasha did it. She just like let it go, and she just like went let um let uh uh, uh the interview be what it's going to be, as opposed to making yeah. it what you want it to be. I think that Sasha is certainly going to win this season of Drag Race, and especially because Mistress. I think they're going to get more mileage out of Mistress as someone returning to RuPaul's Drag Race because Sasha is a little classier. No shade to Mistress, but Sasha's like yeah. kind of classy. You know what I mean? And she's not a she's not like bitchy or anything. Do you believe this thing where Sasha is like? I think Beyonce got the name Sasha Fierce for me. I think Sasha is just kidding. I did. I mean, maybe like Sasha Kobe is in the dance world. She has friends who are dancers who dance, who know Sasha, who dance with her, and then also happen to dance with Beyonce. I just came to the story, they're like, they're like, they're like, they're all at this, they're all at this club, or, or they did a thing with Sasha. Oh my God, this girl, they, they're all at rehearsal Beyonce, and they're all talking like, oh my God, girl, Sasha really turned it out last night. Sasha really, Sasha is such a good dancer. And Beyonce's like, oh, I'm going to name myself Sasha Fierce after another great dancer. I just don't see that, how that became the name. She's like, oh, I'm going to pick well, this name. I also one time in the same way that Beyonce may have gotten a little bit of inspiration from me and Monet was like literally not possible. Like Beyonce can't get inspiration from people. Why can't no, how come me not and, people? How come me, not people. How come me, why you. can't me and Sasha Kobe? Why can't me and Sasha Kobe inspire Beyonce? Not people. You specifically. Or Sasha apparently. Or Sasha Kobe apparently. How come me and Sasha Kobe can't inspire Beyonce? Just not because people. you don't just because you. you don't inspire Beyonce doesn't mean that other people can't. Honey. Yeah, Beyonce started doing wearing hounds because of you, Bob. You, I mean, are, you, I, better, listen, you better drink I've that been, delusion. Drink that. It must be sir, It must be real good. All I'm saying is I've literally inspired Madonna. I've inspired Whoopi Goldberg. You inspired Whoopi uh, Goldberg? Yeah, she said it. How? She said I'm one of, she said I'm one of her favorite people in the world. Where? Literally, you can look, at, Where? look it up. Sasha Cole B. This is Beyonce at the 2006 BET Award. This is almost an exact replica. Like, this looks like... The garment. I'm gagged. Down to the details on the leg. I agree. Like Beyonce's like a looks lot. Like, it looks like Beyonce's hair. It does, but not as good as like Sasha's always known for having really good hair. Sasha always looks really good. This looks like she pulled this. This looks like uh. <laughs> what? You say that wig I used to wear? Are you about, are you about to say that wig I used to wear? I, I can, I can, I, I know you, bitch. I know you. I know how you play the game, and you are playing with the right one. Okay. <laughs> you know, Sasha Kobe has won three challenges before anyone else has won their second. Oh wow! Yeah, she won last week and this week back to back. No one has won two challenges yet, and Sasha Kobe has won. Well, Lucy has won three challenges, but besides Lucy, Lucy and Sasha both have three challenge wins. Yeah. Um, uh, and uh, who do you think is going to the finale? I think the fans are going to be Mistress Isabel Brooks and Sasha Kobe for sure, and that I and I, I and I got to pick this third spot, and I feel like it's either going to be Lucy or Lux. Yeah, I think it's Mistress Sasha and Lux. Okay, this one tickled me pink. They are so harsh on Sasha Selena. Kobe. Oh. No, the opposite. They're so harsh on Selena. Like they like like they're like, you need to cut it down. This that's not fun. One, not funny. Uh two, it's too long. Um, also, are you gonna make it good? And then Sasha Kobe came in with like a the an inkling of an idea. She was like, 
Well, we're thinking that maybe we'll um, be kind of like, and then Michelle was like, yeah, yeah, yeah that, that's something. That's something. Work with that. And Sasha literally had like the idea of an idea. And Michelle was like, brilliant, brilliant. Run with it. Run with it. I, I did write down, I think that Sasha saved herself at the end by working it. And I don't know if it was off the cuff. Or she, they plan to say that, but the whole, uh, the whole Evie's dick and Michelle Ball thing, that, that saved Sasha from being in the bottom. I think that, but uh, up to that point, the set was not great and I did not enjoy it. I disagree. I thought they started off really strong. I really enjoyed their can bits. So let's do a couple of can bits. I enjoyed those a lot. I thought it went downhill when they started doing the, the, the stoner material. In my experience, most jokes about being a stoner just kind of aren't funny. I'm not saying you can't make funny jokes, but I just haven't heard a lot of great jokes. And the idea, I think people think it's just funny that people love weed. And I, just, I just don't think loving weed is funny. And being like, I like, whenever I hear people talk about loving weed, they're always like, make sure that you smoke weed. I love that weed, honey. The weed, weed, weed. The weed, weed. The weed, weed, weed. Like, it's not funny to me. So I really love the beginning. I love the end. The middle was a big sag. It really sagged low i thought this was really dope you know i love me some denim D denim and diamonds i love this look is so good i love 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 this look i love the little hip thing she did at the end which that i this look is so good i love this look honestly when justin timberlake and kim and justin timberlake and britney spears did those denim on denim looks they they really reset the internet they really did i, I really believe well the internet that was like a cultural reset. That was a big moment, I believe. It's gonna be Sasha Kobe, and I will see you at the finale with my with okay. my uh, with my Sasha Who's Kobe the final two? shirt. Sasha and Mistress, for sure. We gotta talk about this look, bitch. This was such a smart and fucking cool way to do gloves. I love this, this the, outfit so this much. This is the best. I will say this: out of all the looks, this is the only look that I would be like the I, the cat is the category gloves. I, this is the yeah. only one that I'm like, is it gloves? Because although Selena did, I feel like I'm more focused on the, the face on her body than I am on the gloves of Selena. This is the only one to me that screams, this is about gloves. And this is the, so dope. This is the best look on the runway, in my humble opinion. It looks so cool. It looks like something you see in a magazine. Like, it, it, yeah. it's so cool. And I thought in the challenge, she was great. I love that she played a man in the challenge. That was, I mean, everyone yeah. played a man in the challenge. Um, but she played the bushest of all the men. Uh, well, oh, yeah. not everyone. Mistress didn't, and neither did uh, yeah. Anitra. Loose, nope. Anitra, yeah. Mistress and Anitra. Um, yeah. But I love that she, yeah, she was really funny. And she, she, I, I hated her dress, but it wasn't her fault. It was like that That dress green dress, her. right? Oh, oh, God of mercy. I would have been mad Bitch. if I was I'm like, Mama, we gotta fix this, Mama. We gotta fix this. It it, it took me back to old uh, Bob the Drag Queen two dress, honey. That's what I was getting. I can't believe they let Sasha get away with saying two names. I cannot believe they let Sasha get away with saying two names. That is wild to me because Sasha said Lux and Lucy, and I cannot believe they weren't like, no, 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 no. We need one. I'm gagged at right. that actually. I would really like them to go back to. S prepared numbers like i really 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 hope we get to do that next year i really hope so i mean this year for the for the finale it was good i, I believe that but if baby if they do that baby if they do that look right now people already think Ooh. that no one can if people already think that no one can touch sasha if they get to make their own numbers sasha's going to fucking <laughs> Oh my God, that sound is so. Um, yeah, no, it is. It, she's going to y'all just go watch Sasha, Sasha, Sasha Kobe's um, Miss Confidence performances. They're just banal. Um, so Sasha and her teacher are like having these conversations, but they want, they both want to like. She's like Sasha's teacher's like, I want to go all the. Oh my God, we are on, we are forty minutes. We have we're barely at. <laughs> we're we're wilding today. <laughs> Sasha is like, no, I want to go in, like, like drag me up. I want drag yeah. down. So Sasha and and Sasha's even going further. Sasha says that she's never. So padded I can go before. further. I can go further. Can I just say, I do not think your first time padding needs to be on RuPaul's Drag Race. I've only seen it happen successfully one time, and it was Naomi Smalls. Um, I think they look really good. I I do not. 
I think that Sasha could have padded a little less. I think that, that here's the thing. I think she, had, you know, it takes a while to figure out what pads look right for you. And Sasha has never padded before. So outside of Sasha, because I, I actually think that Ferocity's padding looks really great, and that Sasha is just a little, a little too. Uh, she needs, she needs some of them more like your old pads they used to wear. And Ferocity, I, I was really gagged at how like she, she kind of is slightly giving Vanessa Williams like yes. she's so pretty. And then I think that uh, the top two are going to be uh, Sasha versus Anitra. And I think that we have, I think that we've seen Sasha like do her thing, but we have not even begun to see Sasha do her thing like with production. Like, y'all, Sasha's about to literally be in her bag. The finale is a pageant. This is what Sasha does. This is her thing. There's going to be Q&A. She's going to eat, 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 eepos and Baninis. okay? She is going to uh, do a production number with people behind her. It's going to be some, um, I hope it is some Hawaiian, indigenous, beautiful, whatever, or you know what I mean? And then she's going to do a one-on-one -on -one lip sync. We're about to see Sasha Kobe, in my opinion, do probably one of the most impressive finale packages that we've seen in a long time. Sasha Colby uh, is the first one to go for the Tic Tac uh, podcast. I guess it's like a hybrid of the two. And she uh, revealed that her father unalived himself at 80. At 80. 80. That is so late in life. That just goes to show you, like, you never know what somebody's going through. Like, that, that, that seems like it's tough. That is fucking tough to know that one of your parents unalived themselves, you know, so late in life. And But he did take care of her. He left her everything, which is Gaggy, I, you know. I, don't, I don't know how I don't know how many siblings she has, but uh, it is really fierce that the the Mahu representative of the family is the one who got uh, everything. Sasha Colby <laughs> also talking about about wanting to dim her light um, because she wants to be liked by the other girls. And she talks about like when she like was winning a lot of challenges, she like kind of did not want to win so the other girls would like her. I feel that cannot relate. Can. <laughs> not relate get your own good things get, get your own good things you don't need my good things go have your own good things mary couldn't be me could not be me never has been never will be sasha looked so fucking hot i i knew the reference immediately she was pam anderson and barbed wire i remember that movie used to come on usa network i love sasha's alien look it's yeah. it's, it's it's it has to be diego montoya or it looks maybe it's not but it looks really good i it was the prompt alien? Yeah, yeah. That's so, what RuPaul said. There, if, there, if the prompt was earlier. alien, I feel like Sasha is, or is it, or is the prompt intergalactic? Because if the prompt was alien, I feel like Sasha's the only one giving alien. It was alien, or like inter, or interstellar, or something like that. Oh, I love both her looks. Bad bitch, body it out. I don't come to play. Best believe when I step on the on the scene. Shady hoes just run away. Dream chaser, star maker, game changer, bank breaker. Crack the code. Now y'all know Sasha Kobe run the show. Again, I don't think these lyrics are particularly groundbreaking or anything. Um, how do you feel about them? Sasha, this is beautiful. I thought yeah. this gown was fucking stunning. The hair, the hair, the hair, the hair, and her face, these lashes, that big old exaggerated crease with the bottom lashes. Her face looks so beautiful. I just hate it. I like the rings on her arm, but I hated the other little bangles in between them, like the ones that you just get for like a dollar in Santiago. Like mm -hmm. I feel like the ring, the big rings were enough. She didn't need those other bangles in between. I, I, didn't, I didn't really clock that. I think she looked really good. I agree with Pretty much most of what you said. I didn't really clock the the little rings, but uh, she looks really nice, and I love these flowers in her hair, and it makes her look so very, good, very ethereal. It makes her look kind of like a dream. I really love this look. I think yeah, Sasha Kobe deserves a win this episode. Yeah, who do you think deserves a win this episode? Even though Mistress had the best verse, but I do think that Sasha had a better overall, better package. Do you know another girl entered the the piss on stage uh, this like season this year? Who? Yep, this season Tell a girl me. did it. Tell me. Like, do you want to guess? Do you want to take one guess out of all the girls? Out of all the girls, I would guess Robin. It was Sasha Kobe. Did she really? Sasha Kobe pissed herself on the main stage. So it's you, <laughs> Pheromone, <laughs> Sasha Kobe. There's a couple more. There's more? Well, there in, the, in the club? That's all There's I know. More, yeah. Jada, Jada, I, know, I forgot. Jada pissed herself on All-Star 7. Oh, shit. Jada Pissed Up All-Star 7. Oh, my God. Me? 
<laughs> Jada, Sasha, Monet. <gasps> Did Sasha win drag? <laughs> <laughs> we all won drag race. Did Sasha win drag? <laughs> oh my god! And Sasha Kobe, I don't really care much for Sasha Kobe's look either. It's it's just why is it so wide in the middle? Like why is that 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 one part? Number seven. I mean number eight. No, nope, number six is Sasha's tie dye look. Sorry. Sasha's tie dye latex look. Um, I don't even know how this tie dye is done because can you like? Dye latex? It must have been dyed, like latex, tie dye latex fabric already, right? I mean, obviously, me and Monet do not work in textiles, but um, anyway, it's it's a great look. This was this, I I loved. I also this look is connected to an iconic moment, which was her and Malaysia versus Lux and Mistress, and they're they're talking, and it just keeps cutting back to Sasha. Oh. And she's like a little bit irritated with this tie dye hat dripping, and she's just like. I just, I it, 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 I it, it, it harkens me back to that moment. Work. Number five, we're going to go with Sasha is back on the list again with her gloves look. Sasha, Colby, this was my favorite no. take on. This is the sixth look. This was my favorite take on gloves in general. Mm -hmm. I just thought that it was so, when everyone else was like wearing gloves, she was wearing gloves, but not on her hands. And that was so unique, so creative. I thought this was just, it was just truly, truly smart. I loved that. Our number two look, which Bitch. is Sasha Colby's puffer look. Bitch. She looked, when I think of this, when I, when I think Sasha, when I, when I think I saw Sasha in this look, is her stomping on that runway and she was, when she had like her hands, she took the coat off and she had her hands on that thing. She looked so Fucking good. Have a shirt with someone's face on it. If you pull their nose out, that shit is so funny. She looks so beautiful. That's actually a very beautiful shirt. I agree. Um, so obviously, if you're watching this, you're you're you don't care about spoilers and um, all hell the queen, um, Sasha Kobe, the, the crown queen of season uh, fifteen of RuPaul's Drag Race. You know, I gotta be yes. honest. This is the least surprising. Um, win in the history of drag race not 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 we, the least uh, not but, the, is, but, i'm trying to think is that is that one that's been more that's been this and so uh, the obvious i think bianca's was pretty clear quite frankly I, like i know I, I people thought people thought that it may have been a door i didn't i never thought that i'm mean, not a door i mean i'm i'm courtney okay Monet. all right okay anyway that's five looks you have to get created for the finale and as we know sasha wore three looks in the finale so Gag. I mean, in the in the last lip sync, yeah. The final, yeah. This look was so good, so yeah. good. My fair lady, honey. I think again, all of all of her looks are great. This middle look is like she's she like a volcano. Like it's like she's like an it's erupting from volcano. Moana, Moana. Oh, she is the the, the angry island. It was Taka and Tafiti. It's it's not it, we, Monet and I recognize it from Moana. We don't. We're not saying that it, that it originated in Moana. Um, yeah. To be clear to everyone. Each of her looks looks so good. I love I think my favorite is honestly this this lava fiery look is really cool. Yeah, I agree. I just don't looks... like they have her holding this fucking ice cream. Why is she holding ice cream? The ice cream is weird. I don't understand why the ice cream either. Her performance was it was the best thing ever. It was clearly hands down the best one from beginning to end. Flawless. She did a number called Goddess. And can I just say, this was, I mean, obviously, this this was what I predicted. We were going to get a Miss Continental level performance out of Sasha for the solo number. And she ate, like, the with the hair and them all holding her hair. And she was whipping her head like she did not care if they ripped the hair out of her head. I was like, she had no, she threw caution to the wind. I was like, girl, they are all holding your hair and you are really whipping it as if if they pull one out, whatever, honey. I'm about to get $200,000. I'll, I'll buy a new patch She'll of hair. She'll get a new one. She's like, I'm, I'm going to Turkey tonight. <laughs> honey, uh, that, that was yeah. fierce. She, she looked amazing. The number was really, really good. This was by far it was really good. By far the best performance of the night. I think the real truth is they just couldn't crown Sasha Miss Congeniality as well. Okay, she truly say, was Miss Congeniality. That's my thing. I know that it's not true. I've never seen it done in a pageant. I don't think it's ever done. But why can't the winner also be Miss Congeniality? Because like, Sasha if you was, both, you both. Sasha's incredibly congenial. 
So let's go into the final um, lip sync, which is Knock the on Wood. Final lip uh, sync. Uh, first of all, can knock, I just say, knock, knock on Wood. That is a great song. That is a drag staple. Um, I do wish that one year the final, final lip sync would be a ballad. Like, I wish that one year the final lip sync would be like, I have nothing, Whitney Houston. Or, or, um, Hero, Mariah Carey. Uh, or, you know, beautiful Christina Aguilera. That being said, this was great, but it, it, it really wasn't a competition. And, and I'm, Anitra did a good job. It just low key wasn't a competition. Well, Sasha, she just had way more levels and way more dynamics in hers. Like she came out in this black gown, then she reveals, and you're like, oh, that was really early. But then she re revealed into another gown. Okay. Uh, good. That was cute. And then she does reveal into this like sexy two piece. I, I would call it a bra. <laughs> I don't think it's really supporting much of anything because it's basically seems... it's basically pasties uh, with the under with yes. the underwire, and she's showing her fucking body, slapping her ass, grabbing her ass, and when she gets on that on that coat that she revealed at the top of it, act like it was a bearskin rug, and she was on this rug. It was a wrap. It was over, and and showing the inches, the bundles. I know Bob hates human hair, but she was uh, I don't really hate fun. Human to hair. That's not true. So let's just go ahead and say what we all know. What we all knew was going to happen since the meet and greet started. Sasha Velour is now the Sasha winner. Sasha Colby. Sasha Colby. Oh my God. I keep the, the, the <laughs> Sasha's. Sasha Colby is the winner of RuPaul's Drag Race. She's American Next Drag Race. Yes. When she won, she said, this goes out. This goes to yes. every trans Love person, this. past, present, and present future. Because we're not going anywhere. I love that. That is one of the most, probably not one of the most, the most powerful. That is the most powerful one we've, uh, uh, accept, not acceptance. Uh, what, what do you want to call it? Uh, it's acceptance. Yeah. yeah. Or it's the declaration. That the, yeah, that know, is the soak most. Soak it up. Soak it up was pretty intense.